from Thanksgiving, and if you don't have your holiday decoration plan set, well, that's your problem. What? What are you waiting for? You should get on it. Here to share the grand plan for our look this year, let's welcome our art director, Kate Taylor, everybody. Hey. Looking beautiful and glowing. Thank you. Okay, so talk, walk us through this. Well, this is your first year in New York. Yes. So we're planning a traditional New York Christmas. Love. You are at Rockefeller Plaza, which is really the heart of all things holiday in New York. Yeah. So it's a super fun place to be. And the best part about the plaza is that they put up the most ginormous tree every year. I've heard. It's amazing. Yeah. Yeah. It's great. A million, yeah. billion people will come to see it. Yeah. But every year, it's usually a Norway spruce, and it's just a gorgeous tree. Yeah. But this year for set, we're partnering again with our friends at Balsam Hill, and they have an amazing collection of artificial trees. They have I know so this. many styles and sizes to choose from. Mm -hmm. They come pre-lit. They're beautiful. Yes, pre-lit, everybody, pre-lit. It's so much easier. Yeah. Yeah, it's great. So we've chosen a Norway spruce to be one of our hero trees for set. It's yeah. a nice nod out to the plaza. I love that. Well, it's always a hot debate whether you like the clear white lights or you like the multicolored lights. Ah. So for set, we're going to use the white lights because they do look better on camera. They yeah. twinkle, they sparkle, they're really nice. Yeah. My husband and I have this major argument every year, though. He loves the colored lights, and I never let him win. <laughs> <laughs> but the great part about a lot of these artificial trees is you have the ability to switch from the white to the multicolored lights with a remote. It's super easy. Yeah. Watch. How good is that? <laughs> It's so fun. This is not a joke. This is a debate with me and my son. He always it wants is. the multicolored, and I'm like, I kind of like the, the classic look, but I right. let him win sometimes. Right, and you can split the difference and do white lights and the multicolored. Lights. What just happened? I know, it's good. This is perfect for families that argue about it. I love that. Yeah. So That's a game changer. Well, yeah. Balsam Hill has so many collections of beautiful ornaments. Mm -hmm. So this is primarily their modern metallics collection, and this is what we've chosen to be the base of our trees. Metallics provide a great neutral, so it's a great starting place for your tree. We're gonna add in some red and green. Splashes, yeah. Yeah, for the festive feel, but it's a good investment because next year you could put pink with it or put blue with it. And yeah, if you're someone, Yeah, if you're someone who likes to change up your tree, this is a really good thing to invest in. All right, all right, what's next? Well, sometimes when you finish decorating your tree, you end up with a lot of extra ornaments. So what do you do with them? There's a million quick things. Well, I'm not art, artsy enough, so I put <laughs> I them back in the box. <laughs> nope, I promise. These are easy enough that you can do them. Okay. I love to put them under glass Never domes. Never thought this. Oh my God. This yeah. is such an easy thing, and yeah. it's great because they stay safe from little hands if you have kids, well, so nobody can touch them. Yeah. That's a super. And with the little velvet bow, that's yeah. cute. They're really easy. Yeah. The other quick thing is you can just put them in footed bowls. Honestly, even if you have a set of mixing bowls with mm -hmm. different heights. It's super easy. You can put this together in about a minute. That's cute. And then I just tuck in some glittery sprays and they're really festive. You can put them all over. Yeah. Another great tip is to adorn your packages. I have done this. Yeah, this yeah. is so easy. People are always asking me how to make their gifts look nicer and these are all just store-bought bows and all you have to do is tie on an ornament and it's so special. Yeah, it looks and way And then better. it's so fun when you put your tree together the next year. To, they look all magical. Yeah, yeah, to remember who gave you this ornament and where it came from. Yeah. It really adds to the magic Or re-gifted on accident. Or <laughs> that happens too. <laughs> totally. <laughs> all right. Oh, I like this one too. That's pretty. Yeah, yeah. this is a great one. Okay. So here I use this for if you want to put together a quick table setting. Ornaments are a great place to use those. So I just laid down a really simple green garland, which is beautiful on its own. Yeah. But you can wire in ornaments, which keep it safe from pets and kids. kids I just yeah. put a thin gauge wire on, and you just have to wrap it around. Uh, it comes together really quick. You can do this in like 10 minutes, and then you can make a nice place card holder. That's adorable. That's a great place to get your kids involved. I want to throw a dinner party just so I can do that. Yeah, yeah. you just use a paint marker, and it comes together really quick and fun, and then your guests can take them home. That's so great. You did so awesome. Thank this is you. so great. I love it. Throwing in the little birds. I love all of it. Thank you so much to Kate. Give it up. A special thank you to our friends at Balsam Hill. Shop their website to get the most realistic Christmas trees and beautiful decor this season. And check out Rockefeller Center's A Play Skate Chalet, presented by Balsam Hill. It's overlooking the ice skating rink, and we'll be right back with what I'm liking, everybody.